This is a very brief demo of the uh, BMS operating with the completed battery packs. You can see the data transmission cycling around the pack. A small delay there was while the BMS calculated the state of charge. It does that once a minute. Now I'm going to move the video camera now around to the BMS display. I'm hoping you can see the display there. I'm just going to demonstrate what happens if there's a data uh, error. For instance, one of the packs or cells fails to communicate. I'm just going to disconnect the second half of the battery pack. You can, sell it, you can see it's immediately indicating an error with cell 26, which is the first one in the second pack and you can probably hear the tone in the background indicating an error. Just going over to the master board. You can see the master board alarm signals flashing. So it's coming on well. I'm hoping to install within the next six weeks. I'm now waiting for uh, Zivan NG3 charger to come from Italy. That'll be approximately six weeks. I'll just reconnect the data connector and it should silence the alarm which it has we go back to the display you see we're now back to uh, system nominal now, if the charge had been operating at that point when the error occurred it would have immediately tripped off the charger and the charger can only be reset by resetting the master board or reinitializing the charging sequence the charging sequence won't restart after an error without the user's intervention. Okay, that's, for, that's it for today.